In this quick video, we're going to show you how to add apps to the new hidden folder on iPhone that's running iOS 18. Before we start with this video, if you're new here, make sure to subscribe to AppTutor for more similar iOS 18 and other tutorial videos like this one. So without wasting your time, let's start right away. Make sure that you're running the latest iOS 18 software update and now the next thing that we'll do is to find the app which we want to add to the hidden folder. Let's say I want to hide the TikTok application and add it to the hidden folder. Well, we will long hold or long press the TikTok application until these options appear. And maybe you'll notice that we don't have the hide button anywhere, but don't worry. What you want to do is to click on this require face ID option right here and this little pop-up window will appear. You see, when we want to hide an app from our home screen and add it to a hidden folder, we will also have to lock the application with Face ID. So let's click on this Hide and Require Face ID option. The phone will scan our face, and you'll see this pop up. It says here that this app will no longer be visible on your iPhone, except in a few places such as the settings. Face ID or a passcode will be required in order to reveal or open the application, and the app will be now added in the hidden folder. I will also hide the Facebook app for the purpose of this video, and the apps will now be hidden, and only I can access them. If you want to access the hidden folder, just swipe to the right side and open your app library, then scroll all the way to the bottom. If you want to see which apps are hidden in this folder, tap on it one time, the iPhone will scan your face, and then it will show you the hidden apps. If you want to remove the apps from the hidden folder and unhide them, I have a separate step-by-step -step tutorial on how you can do that, so I will leave the video link in the description or comments of this video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.